New at 5, it is day 26 of this sort of non-stop spectacular fall weather in our region today. But of course, these comfortable temperatures and the changing leaves mm -hmm. and the sunshine, they come with some downsides. Yeah, a summer drought watch still hasn't been lifted yet, and we're dealing with an enhanced risk of fires like this one right here burning at this hour in Frederick County, Maryland. The Potomac River is also low. Here's our environmental reporter, Scott Broom. How dry is it? Well, where I'm standing right now is normally underwater at this time of year. This is the Potomac River, Loudoun County, Virginia on that side, Frederick County, Maryland on the other side. It hasn't rained in quite a while. There has been no significant rain in the region since October 2nd. This low water in the Potomac, far below average for this time of year, is one result. Another is fire danger. Today, a brush fire in Frederick County, Maryland, near Myersville, scorched about 15 acres before 100 firefighters from three surrounding counties contained it. No structures were threatened. The fire broke out after a weekend burn ban in Frederick County was lifted. Fire authorities in the county report they may be revisiting that decision after investigating the cause of this blaze, which has not been determined. Back on the Potomac River, the region's water authorities have had the metro area in a drought watch condition since July 26, asking residents to make voluntary efforts to avoid wasting water. The Washington Metropolitan Council of Governments will be meeting Thursday to discuss extending the watch. All of this underscoring the unique vulnerability of the region to water disruption because of dependency on the Potomac River as the only water source for 4 million people according to the Interstate Commission on the Potomac River Basin, which has studied costly solutions like converting the Trevilla Quarry in Montgomery County into a reservoir in the coming decades. The upside of all this has been 26 days of spectacularly dry fall weather for Adrian and Lauren Waddell strolling with baby Leo today. We love this weather. We hope it lasts for longer, well, except Halloween. It's going to be 78 degrees. And we have a very warm costume that might be a problem. <laughs> but otherwise, <laughs> yes, we like this weather. Along the beautiful but unusually low-flowing Potomac River, I'm Scott Broom, WUSA 9.